What's up guys? I'm Clifton. I'm Austin. And today we're going to talk about our experiences, the crazy experience we've ever had like when we was younger. So he's yeah. going to go first, by the way. Okay, I'm going to go first. Um, This happened, uh, it was 2011, so it was like, it was seven years ago. Mm. Uh, I w my family, we went to the beach in South Carolina. And, you know, we were swimming, having a good time. But we wasn't, like, in the ocean. It was, like, there was this hole, like, right in front of the ocean, like, where there was sand here, then the ocean. I don't know why it did that. It was, that's what we were swimming in, a little hole. Um, and then uh, the people we were with, they felt something, like, hit their foot. So it just scared us, so we started swimming away. And then I got stung by a jellyfish on my ankle and it hurt, but I was still scared. So I kept swimming and then we got, got out and it looked pretty like a jellyfish sting would look. And um, my little brother, Kobe, uh, peed in a little toy truck and wow. They poured it on it because, like, they they say pee takes away the sting. And it did. It works. So if you ever get stung by a jellyfish, you know, don't be afraid to let somebody put some pee, pee on, on it. <laughs> so, I mean, that was pretty crazy, you know. Oh, wow. Mm. All right. Mine was kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy? It's kind of crazy. Not really crazy. It's just kind of crazy. It was crazy. But... <clears throat> so me and my little cousin, the time, we're walking. No, it. Let me see. It was me, my cousin Keija, and my little cousin Katana as well. We were walking on this uh, street by my grandmama's house, and we were just walking, you know, talking, laughing, all that good stuff. All of a sudden, there was this dog, like running, like back and forth. It was running back and forth, like between, like back and forth across the street or whatever, and it was barking, going crazy. So we ain't paying no mind. I mean, my little cousin was scared, so she had she held on to me. So I'm like, okay, see, I see, they're looking at looking at me for protection. So I gotta kind of defend them, even though I was low key scared myself. So the dog <laughs> looks at us, and it starts chasing after us, right? So I'm saying, hey, here's your tongue. Y'all get behind me. I turn around, they gone. Don't know where they went. They completely disappeared. So I run. I, t I take off running. And I jump in the back of this lady's truck. Don't know who the lady was, but I jumped in her truck, though. And the dog was still barking. So I'm waiting on the dog to leave. The dog leaves. Right, so I'm sitting there for for at least about 20 minutes. Then I look over and there's this lady, this old lady, with a hammer, sitting outside her truck. <laughs> and she's like, "What are you doing in there?" I said, "There's a dog trying to eat me, and if you don't want to get bit, you better get back in the house, lady." She's like, "You do know you're my truck, right?" So I'm like, "Yeah, I noticed that." But she gets me out of the truck. And she's like, she's looking for my little cousins or whatever. They come up to me like, hey, what happened? And I'm sitting there like, well, I don't know if y'all was there with me. Y'all would have saw what happened. But they completely left. I don't know where they went. But they just like left me to be eaten by a dog. Then we go back to my grandmama's house. Tell them about it. And then I had to walk them back home. So I'm walking them home. Same dog comes. This time I got like a huge stick in my hand, right? Same dog comes. I'm trying to swing at the dog with the stick. I'm talking to the dog. I'm like, what's up? What you going to do? Blah, blah, blah. And I'm swinging at the dog with the stick. And they standing behind me. And the dog is not running. It's not doing nothing. It's like trying to, like, bro, it's like real life trying to get at us. Most dogs would just sit and bark at you. But this dog was trying to for real eat us. So, here comes the lady, run back outside with the hammer. 
talking about some, get out of here, get out of here. And she's swinging a hammer and the dog takes off running. She like, are y'all okay? And I say, I mean, I'm grateful that she helped us out. But I'm like, how'd you even see that? That's, that's what I was trying to figure out. She must have been watching us walk home or something like that. But that was that was the crazy the crazy experience I had with the with the dog, man. I didn't like dogs after that ever since, but I like dogs now though. That dog scared the crap out of me. I don't know where it is, but it need to stay where it is. Swearing that story was intense. Yeah, uh, <laughs> you know, dogs are nice, so uh, I don't know what you did to make that dog mad. I didn't do nothing. Because uh, dogs are just naturally nice. Yeah. Jellyfish are mean. <laughs> jellyfish, jellyfish are nice. <laughs> All jellyfish are naturally nice. <laughs> Whew. Oh man, that's a crazy story. Well, that is all we have. Uh, hope you enjoyed our stories. Uh, thanks for watching. 50 likes. Me and Austin will battle rap each other. Ooh. Oh, yeah. 50 likes. <laughs> we'll battle rap likes. each other. 50 we'll likes. We'll have a rap battle. Rap battle. Absolutely. Share this and get, get, get it to 50 likes. 50 likes. And also subscribe. Yeah. That's also it. subscribe and follow our social media accounts. The links will be in the description. Yep. Um, today, it's Dylan's birthday. My Yo. brother Dylan, September sixth. Happy, happy birthday, Dylan. Dylan. Oh, snap. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. Have a great day. Peace. <laughs>